I loved your parts in Frozen 2, Thank and I you. want to know what made you want to be part of it, and what did you have to do to get the role? Mm. Do you want to start? Yeah, sure. I mean, <laughs> I, I, well, I think we both grew up loving Disney yes. movies and Disney musicals, and um, and so uh, I really, you know, when I got the 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 email about auditioning for it, I was super excited because it's also such a huge scale. I yes. mean, everybody knows Frozen. Everybody knows the songs. And um, and then I got immediately terrified and scared when I saw that I had to sing. I'd never sung in an audition before. I love singing. I sing all the time uh, in private, <laughs> in my car. Um, but uh, but yeah, so I, I um, uh, we went in. I did a monologue and a little uh, nervous song, and they told me to come back in a month after going to a vocal coach for a little while. <laughs> and I did that, and I came in with a different song, and uh, and then and then here I am. Oh, here you are. Yeah. <laughs> um, I had a little bit of a different experience. Mm -hmm. um, I had never done voiceover. I can't. E here I am talking about voiceover, and I can't even I've never speak. done voiceover. But I've never ever. done voiceover. I don't ever. know what voiceover is. Um, I've never done voiceover before, and I had never had a voiceover audition. Mm -hmm. um, and so it's kind of a long story. But long story short, my team ended up getting Jamie on the phone, mm -hmm. the casting director, in regards to another client, and found out she was casting Frozen 2. Thankfully thought of me and one other person, sent our stuff over, and oh. she said yes to me, and I got an audition that following week. Oh, wow. um, and I'm a massive fan of mm -hmm. the first one. So I was beside myself, um, but in no way, shape, or form thought that like this would mm -hmm. be something I could actually book. Um, and I saw that I had to do a David Mamet monologue and then sing a song. Yes, wow. David I Mamet know. for Frozen. I was like, all right, Disney, yeah. That's not how messing around. Yeah, exactly. yeah. Lots of swears. I was like, OK. <laughs> And I went to NYU mm -hmm. Tisch for Musical Theater, so I was like, okay, this is in my wheelhouse. Mm -hmm. Like, I've prepared for this. So just went in and did the best I could do with the training I've had. And Jamie told me in the room I'd be coming back for a director-producer session in like a month, month and a half. Oh, cool. And I could have just died right there. <laughs> I was so happy even just to get that news. And mm -hmm. then, yeah, the rest is kind of history. Mm -hmm. And didn't receive the phone call till about like two months after mm -hmm. that session. No nerve wracking. It was it wasn't because I let it go. Like I was excited. You what? I, <laughs> oh now it's your turn to make the pun. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You let it, what? I let it go. Oh, okay. I did. I let it go. <laughs> into the unknown. Exactly. Yeah, into the, exactly. Wow. We could do this for days. All day. <laughs> um and because it it just like wasn't I was just so proud of how I felt in the room mm -hmm. and getting to meet my like heroes yeah. and then left being like, okay, I feel good about that. You do that. what you need to do. I did yeah. what I needed to do. <laughs> and then the phone call was just like cherry on top. Yeah. So now moving from the history to the future, Yes. Mm -hmm. um, what do you guys think that Honey Marin and Ryder are doing now that they are free from the curse? How are they living They're their life? Exploring yes. uh, outside yeah. of those woods. I think Ryder is like, how can I not see another tree for a year? <laughs> Now, where's where's the least amount of trees? Yeah. Probably talking to reindeers that have been outside. Yes, exactly. And getting their information. <laughs> That's getting their like, information. Like, what was life like for you? It's getting advice about uh, yeah. interacting with other humans. Reindeer uh, reconnaissance. Totally. Yes, exactly. Reindeers I, are yeah. very insightful, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I think Honey Marin is probably learning a lot from Elsa and is so mm -hmm. curious about, like, her powers mm -hmm. and... And um, as I'm sure Elsa is like discovering more about herself and, and um, this new life that she now has with our people, mm -hmm. and I think they're probably all teaching each other things. Yeah. I love that. And I like to imagine more scenes of Honey Marin and Elsa in my Me mind. Me too. That was a great little friendship there, yes. just like uh, Ryder and Kristoff. We love, I agree. Now, is there any friendships. one thing that you hope to see or that you hope fans get to see on the uh, special features and the home release? Oh, any? I'm. Uh, I mean, I'm. I'm more excited about what I get to see. Same. <laughs> I'm really excited. I mean, I, well, we all get to see. But uh, <laughs> yeah, when I heard there was going to be, I love special features, especially for movies that I love. I love seeing behind the scenes stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, because you see the movie so many times, and then you get to see like another angle of the set. Right. Or I mean, I know that won't happen on this because it's <laughs> animated. But you get to see the process. Yeah. You get to see outtakes. Um, it just makes you appreciate what you're watching right. so much more. Yeah. Yeah, and 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 to know that to know how much work goes yeah. into it that never gets seen. It's such mm -hmm. a it's such a painful thing mm -hmm. as a filmmaker to have to cut something out mm -hmm. just because it's 
you know too long yeah. or it doesn't move the story enough. Far. So it's and uh, so I also love seeing deleted scenes and and being like that could have stayed in. Yeah. Uh, if that was <laughs> like me, my directorial choice. Yeah, yeah. Just yeah. To keep it in. no, that <laughs> deserved to stay out. Or, or trying to understand, yeah, like yeah. why I mm -hmm. I think that's a beautiful song. I understand why they right. cut it, and you know, getting to know the process of it, and it's a way to learn too. Yeah, about that's true. All that story well, thank you guys stuff. for your insight. That was very thank educational. You. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>